I think our discussions are going a little off. But not, I need. I may That's why I may I may be, sure I may be, per I may be permitted to address your lordship for just five minutes. Of course. Who said no? No, but not before you further proceed, below. I was patiently sure. listening Thank everything you. You. because one, I think the the all issues. One second. Not... One second. One second. Yes. One one of your colleagues is in. No, no, I, I only want one sentence to be permitted. After, after he finishes, we'll hear others. No, no, I only wanted to say one sentence. Yeah. Hear me in one sentence. Please. One sentence. One sentence only. The whole question before the court is whether the test should be examination be cancelled or and a re-examination to be conducted. The discussion is far away from that. that no, is, no. This is the heart of it. No, no, no. We have to look at the Manor, evidence, Manor, the underlying evidentiary record Manor, to see whether Manor, there are Manor, Manor, that is a major administrative decision. It is not depending on a minor irregularity here or there. It's a major administrative decision. But for a minor irregularity here all or right, there. All right, all right. Mr. Nedumara, one second. Yes. We were a little confused. Are you on this side or on that side? No, no, no. <laughs> no, I am for the petitioners and my submission is. You are saying no retest. No, no, no. Absolutely. The only way is to conduct a retest. Oh, okay, okay. Then that's and okay. no, I want I to use a very, were, very soft no terminology. Retest. Very soft terminology. I discussed with the IIT professor. He used a strong terminology. I don't, I'm not using it. He used the terminology the professor used was the. Manod, the IIT report, he said, Manod, there are three types of uh, lies. Lies, damn lies, and now IIT report. Data. Let's not, let's not. No, no, I'm, I'm not, I'm not using it. I'm not saying that. I'm, 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 I'm not using it. That's not fair. Mr. Nedubara, also not, one second. Let's not just damn a it's no, no, institute. Not, it's so easy to say something about a premier. No, Manod, give us, give us. Core facts. Give us core facts. No, Lord, I am no, I am very soft on them. I am, Give us I am, core facts. If my Lord were to hear the cold if facts, I can I point out just one aspect. Exam, my Lord, Lord, if I can just say one aspect before my Lord. Alright, we'll come back after lunch. Then you before my friend proceed, allow me to intervene for ten minutes. That will have a different course of direction. Don't intervene right now. Let him argue. All right, all right, yes. No, my Lord, yeah, give me some time. Is. My friend has taken a long time. I have no quarrel. I have to attend some other matter. I'll be grateful. I will only take 10 minutes. That, would be that, that I am <laughs> 10 but, minutes. But, but, I, uh, my Lord, if you go by if you go by seniority, I am 66, I'm senior. But we, we have followed a different rule. I have no quarrel. No, no, no. There. I have no quarrel. I agree yes. standard, Mr. Uh, you no, know, Mr. 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 Uh, Tushar Mehta, you are only 59. Do you need to mean bar and age? Yes. Please don't insult seniors. But my lord, I only take 10 minutes. One second, any group matter, one person leads. No, my lord, I only take 10 minutes, my lord. We are also. We no, are because also I believe that he is. Second, Mr. Nedumbara, it would be wrong to say that he has taken time. We are also. Uh, no, no, I am not blaming anybody, my lord. I am only requesting 10 minutes to be given to me. Then, my lord, I believe me. That's all. 10 minutes to me. 10 minutes to me, my lord. I, if I can, before lunch, my lord, I have another matter to me. I'm taking adjournment after adjournment, Madras High Court. I want to appear online. All right. So, 10 minutes. I bow down. I, I quite understand. These are two compartments. There are two compartments. So far as one talks discussion. about paper leak and to what extent the students took advantage of that leak. Let, let me answer the uh, Lashia's question. Please, please take your seat, Mr. Nedumbara. These are bad manners. Bad manners. I am not very sophisticated like my Lord, the Chief Justice. You may feel bad. Please, please. Three times I have said, please, quiet. We have two minutes to go. We are making Mr. Huda understand what is going on in our mind so that he can respond after recess. Therefore, I asked you the question. That's why we want your assistance. Can, can the court or would the court be justified in a situation like the one present? To say that, not on the basis of material which we have today, but on the hypothesis that some material in the future may show that the leak had gone beyond Hazari Bagh and Patna, therefore today we cancel the exam on the basis of a hypothesis. May I answer, my lord? May not happen in future. May I answer? No, 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 no. When I answer, when I speak, no, Matthew, when I wanted to speak, speak your lordship prevents me. You please sit down. No, when I when I am I'm, I'm the among the senior among the lawyers here, I am the senior most. Sorry, you are not an amicus. I have not amicus appointed. No, no, I am appearing for 10, 16 students. Right. When I wanted to speak, the honourable chief justice prevent me from speaking. 
But one yes, thing he said, I wanted to want to say it was I wasn't yes, allowed to speak. Uh, yes, Mr. But I, when I was speaking, your lordship was showing the other side. Yes, Mr. And I have only one word to say. Only yes, one word thing. Mr. Mr. Matthews, to say. Uh, please call the security people. Have him, have him removed from the court, please. I only want to answer. Uh, you will, you that will not say anything. You will not speak to the gallery. You will listen to me. I am in charge of my courtroom. Listening. Uh, you just keep quiet now. Yes, Mr. Huda. Yes, Mr. Huda. Yes, Mr. Uh, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Yes, Mr. Huda. Unfair. Yes, yes, Mr. Huda. Wait, wait, please. This, this is not a judicial. Mr. Mr. Matthews, I'm. I will now be constrained to issue something which is very unpleasant. Please keep quiet. Sit down here. You want to leave? It's your choice. I'm That's leaving. I'm leaving. You don't have he to. Said, you do not have to intervene. You don't have to tell me that you are leaving. Yes. No, because I, I sought permission. To, is, I sought permission to speak. Matthews. You will not interrupt Mr. Huda. I, I will hear you, but I'll hear you after Mr. Huda is done. I am in charge of procedure in this court. And I've been I've seen this court, I've seen the judiciary for the last 24 years. I will not allow any lawyer to dictate the procedure of the court. I have seen the, I will give you I will give you a full hearing, but after Mr. Huda. All right, is all right, done. all right. Yes. I have been the, I have, yes, I've been seeing judiciary since 1979. <laughs> Yes, 79. May I, may I let, uh, this is contemptuous. Uh, what you are talking my, about? My uh, response is Willard, straight away. I am leaving. Issue. I, had, I, I wanted to answer two one question of this, Justice Padivada and Justice Lordship's question. And, and uh, when the questions are raised, any member of the bar who was actively participating in the discussion can certainly answer it. And I did not do anything wrong. And I am sorry. I was unfairly treated. Yeah. That's a different story. Now that's a different story. Let me come in, come, come into the case. Make your submission. No, make, make coming to coming to the state. Now I am amazed by the kind of discussions which has been going on here. We have been conducting a criminal trial. We are going to the niceties. We have called the CBI. But solicit what kind of discussions which have been going on? The issue is you ask a common man. A man in the street, there is an examination leak. I came on my petition, I said only one thing. There has been a leak. A leak has been uh, is, uh, happened. Then there is no alternative. There is no alternative than a retest. It certainly leaves inconvenience. Certainly. And only means, only thing that can be th thought of is how to reduce inconvenience. And I made a suggestion, which my friend also uh, adopted, that this test be conducted as a need preliminary examination. 13 lakh students are qualified. And that, that be, they'll be taken for the final examination. And this, this is an administrative issue. Today, because of PAS, etc., we treat many things which are in the realm of falling in the exclu exclusive realm of governance into the court. And my Lord, therefore, therefore this, is a, this is something the government did a great injustice to the court. The government, is a, it was a, their problem. It, it was a, a issue of a governance and the government, government very conveniently, very conveniently did not raise the maintainability of these petitions, allowed, the, allowed questions, the detailed arguments to be made for days and days. And they are, they are literally shunning away from their responsibility. There is a government. This is, a, this is an issue concerning lakhs of people. It is a call of the minister. It is a call of the government. And the government has failed to. I'm not anti BJP man. In fact, I supported BJP. I, 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 I advocated for voting for BJP. I should have. But what happened today? This is something utterly, I'm not using a very strong expression, unacceptable. The government of the day is accountable to the people. When your lordship, I always say, when your lordship takes a decision, 
may not that only binds the parties before you when a parliament takes a decision we are all in we are all present in the parliament and we are symbolically present in the parliament it binds all of us in the last couple of years the governance what the parliament ought to do what the government ought to do it is being the courts are forced to do courts are forced to do therefore my the question today is the question today is is what is the given situation what is to be done admittedly there is a leak and it leaves no option than to cancel the examination as rightly justice uh, justice Vikramnath, justice Vikramnath has said 0.00 percent doubt examination has to be cancelled and that is the only option this is a matter which should have been concluded in 20 minutes and good that we spend a good lot of time I'm no quarrel about it and therefore and my advice to the court is that court should not enter into the domain of the executive let the government do its job let the government answer to the people the parliament is going on session is going on the very neat issue is before the parliament and here is a solicitor general he doesn't even oppose i'm for the petitioner i'm i'm strongly advocating the cancellation of this examination still i said as a matter of principle a lawyer has to speak about the fundamental constitutional principle. A fundamental constitutional principle is that these are our administrative issues. And if, assuming that the government, at least the matter should have been delegated to the government, government should have taken a director to issue, take a decision. And the government, if uh, supposing that the government has taken a decision after hearing both of us, parties affected, not, not only those who are asking for cancellation of the examination, but also those who are asking for non-cancellation of the examination because they have they are the ones who stand to benefit by the results. The both parties, to the extent possible, unlike a court, the government is under no obligation to hear everybody. That, because the government represents the people and therefore no obligation to hear everybody. But court, when a court is decides a matter, it, it is under a duty to my Lord, listen to everybody. Otherwise, my Lord, that Rasindor, Alio, Sakta, Altori, Nazari, non -debit. Court has no jurisdiction to bind anybody who is not before it. So the, having this fundamental principle being stated, and, and whenever every every PAL comes before this court, this court should certainly adjust to itself. The people affected are not here, and we are we don't represent the people of this country, and and these issues concerning the public at large cannot be decided behind the back of them. These proceedings are not in uh, representative proceedings. These are proceedings. In my case, uh, 16 with the students were affected by it. Therefore, my Lord, when this case came, the only option is to throw the ball to back to the government's court and the government to take a call uh, on the question of cancellation. And the government would have done it in moments' time. It wouldn't have been able to justify this, this examination, no, not even one moment. The government would have come with the conclusion, the, the decision to cancel it forthwith. And the government conveniently, very conveniently, saying that is a non-adjudicatory, non the solicitor general says, non-adjudicatory litigation. What is that? Non-adjudicatory. There is nothing like non-adjudicatory. Court's job is to decide uh, disputes. Uh, court's duty is to de decide dispute or questions of fact and apply the law. If the issues are non-adjudicatory, non there is nothing. It is administrative. And well, Lord, I conclude by saying one word. My Lord, I forgive your Lordship for all the insult to me and my Lord, humiliation. I forgive your Lordship, Lord, forgive them for they not, for they not know what they are doing. I, for, I have nothing in my mind. I have the greatest of regard for your Lordship and Lordship Padivala also. I have the greatest of regard, though I was insulted. I don't keep, keep, keep anything in my mind. But my Lord, this, this neat examination has to be cancelled forthwith. It cannot be delayed one minute because precious time of these students are lost. And a fresh examination has to be conducted forthwith. And it is for the, the government to decide whether it has to be for the 13 lakh students who are selected or it has to be for a lesser number. And these are areas where the court should step in because what is governing the, the matters of administration, the, but those in governance alone come to know about it. Somebody said, it's a, certainly new, NEET is a very loosely conducted all outsourced. But that is true. But in, in a governance, outsourcing is necessary. Without which no government can function. Everything, the need department cannot do it. So most of the things which my friend Hoda and Sanjay Khadge argued, I, with respect, I disagree with that. 
And only my submission is, this is an issue which should be thrown to the government's court. Let them decide. Let them decide. Let the parliament is going. Let them answer to the parliament. And let them not shirk their responsibility and pour, uh, throw all public issues to the court's domain. Because I say so, because average time, which is which a, which an ordinary litigant who comes for a grievances, is 93 seconds. When I come to your lawsuits for the SLP, it is dismissed in 93 seconds. And I had a recent incident where my SLP was dismissed even 60 seconds. So therefore, we have to revisit it. The PA business has to be discouraged. And only petitions here, at least affected parties are there. My petition is not PAL. My petition is somebody who is seeking declaration of their fundamental rights. And my lord, I conclude the research has to be cancelled, examination has to be recontested. Greatly obliged.